Yeah, I'm Gabe Brailsford, I'm the team principal of Team Sky and I run the British Cycling Olympic team for 15 years. Marginal gains to me is um, improvement through small steps. The idea was to get people to think that they could improve and once you started that it kind of created this contagious sort of environment where you had this continuous improvement sort of philosophy that everybody became engaged with. Not investing in people is a huge risk. A team isn't a thing, it's a group of people all working together to become a team. To recruit the best people that you could possibly find. And I think the behavioural fit is more important than the core skill necessarily. You can educate and teach the core skills, but that fit in, in terms of trying to create the right culture is, is massively important. We've got this term about podium people. Who's the best in the world at the minute? Where are you and how are we going to get there? give people ownership. The more that people have ownership, the more motivated they'll be, the more creative they'll be. With ownership comes accountability. You can't empower people without making sure there's accountability and responsibility. Provide absolute clarity over role. What does that person's role entail? Unless somebody accepts the role, genuinely internally accepts that role and believes that it's the right thing to do, they won't do it. So you have to double check and really make sure you've got that role acceptance part of the process mapped out. It's very, very important to try and identify the standards that you're going to set. And that could be the value standards, it could be behavioural standards, it could be performance standards. You're a leader, you're an educator. You've got to help people and teach them how to get there. If you can create this positive environment where people can go and confront each other, be honest with each other, give each other feedback in a positive way, then you're in a good place. We can only be as good as we can be. Whatever the external benchmark may be, I think somebody who performs to their optimum, who achieves personal excellence, is an outperformer.